be not to be that is the question through whether tis noble in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune or to take arms against the sea of troubles and by opposing end them to die to sleep no more and for by sleep to say that we end the heartache in the thousand natural shocks that flesh is heir to, tis a consummation devoutly to be wished, to die, to sleep, to sleep, perchance to dream, I, there's the rub. I'm telling you, you got a bright future behind you. You're a what? What? You're a half-eaten what? <laughs> I'm a half-eaten Cheeto. I look like a half-eaten Cheeto today. He really does. You. Caffeine withdrawal is coming in hot. I've been seven days clean with it. Yeah, he's been seven days clean with caffeine, and I'm actually really excited about it. I need, I need to stop it. I haven't. I mean, I haven't. But I haven't. I mean, I haven't. Yeah, I'm not gonna talk about what I've been doing. You anyway, drink a lot of caffeine. I tell you. Uh, I yeah. will. But I also do pre-workout, which is, does not help. Because like, that's like 650 milligrams of... That's an echo that can be so, heard around the world. Someone could have... <laughs> <laughs> all right. No, all right. But I don't think I was recording over there. Me and G are out here, and I almost slapped him in the face. And we're going to be doing actually something very serious. A six-hole match out here at the junior course. Very serious. Person trying to win. So it's not like we're just going to be playing some sort of challenges. Actual serious golf. So you're going to be seeing some some dialed in stuff um, very serious yeah he was playing really good yesterday i was playing decent i mean it's just the gameplay is it's slowly starting it's slowly starting to get into the summer so we're slowly starting to take it a bit more serious guys i haven't hit the yeah. hooks in a very long time so today my goal is to hit it straight and if i miss miss right and make every putt i look at kind of like yesterday yeah except for the, the putting the greens out here you guys know are way better than augustus so you know it's tough to make putts out here it's about a 17 on the step meter rolling about 35. Rolling about 35. So we're kind of just going to get right involved here. Um, fill them with the venom and eliminate them. Half eaten Cheeto. Half eaten Cheetos all the way. Uh, it's stroke play. No gimme, no get, well, no gimme putts. We're probably not going to do gimme putts because you never know it here at the junior course. I was like a foot and I put it and it was, it like hit a bump and jumped over the hole. It did some nonsense. We're not going to talk about what happened. Back tease. Back to you. Back to you, Steve. It's going to be a, probably a million dollars we're playing for. Uh, Monopoly money. Monopoly money, of course, because we... <laughs> Don't have a million dollars. We're big timers, so... Guys, I got 7 iron on the first hole. Probably not a club for club, because it's a little into the wind. A little left to right. So, I'm going to just have to dial it in. Hit it up the left side with a little fade. Maybe a little draw up against the wind. Let it fade back into the hole first track. Got to go over these weeds here in Matt's home. <laughs> Dude, look at my house over there, you guys. Look at that. That looks so good. Kitchen is on. I forgot to turn the microwave off. <laughs> Take that out. Garrett now seven iron, hitting it's the tough push. It's hard to focus in today's match, but I gotta dial it in. It's gotta go, but it's right at it if I just hit the dang ball. All right, and I followed that all the way down to the, to the the over the weeds there. The tracers are gonna be really good because it's a clear sky. Yeah, guys, no hook. Matt's taking one of my balls here. He grabbed one of my balls out of my bag. Grab your ball out of your bag, and I'm gonna try not to lose it. What club do you got here on I'm the gonna, I'm gonna use a seven iron. I think that's a perfect club choice. I actually agree. Seven iron's a, it's a great day off. It's a great day off. The sun is shining. I should have hit my seven iron a little harder. Yeah, I mean, I'm fine. I just got a chip to get up and down for a little. Matt with seven iron. Look at that trace. See, guys, no one's better than me. That's. That was a really good shot. First day in the like first shot of the day. I think that was probably the best tracer anybody's ever seen. Just wait till yours you was really good though too. I'm telling you, it was dead center of the frame though. I'm the center of the frame. Watch this. Here it's so go. nice out. You guys, if you have not yet gotten outside today, you need to go do that. But more importantly, if you have not yet subscribed to me or Garrett, I'm sh at this point. I'm not quite sure what you're doing. Right? You guys are all watching the videos. Right, you see our faces and you don't subscribe. Get a grip with your reality. Okay. Fa so face it. Lots of golf content. If you guys are not golfers, then you should probably subscribe because we do a lot of golf content. Yes, exactly. Oh, big news. I also just started my VLOG channel, my vlog channel yesterday, and I did a really cool Hamlet piece, right? Super serious stuff over there. So if you haven't seen that either, then get a grip. All right, so my ball has landed right there on the green. And is this a part three or part four? It's a part three. 
Par three, okay, that's what I thought. So I'm putting right there for birdie, and Garrett is just off the edge of the green. He was plugged a little bit, and it's really wet out here, so we're gonna be- I think that's my ball. It is really wet out here, so we are gonna be doing like clean, like lift, clean, and replace um, on most of the places out here because it's really wet. So we're gonna try and find Garrett's ball now. All right, so we literally walked over Garrett's ball right through that path, and it, it was, was apparently plugged. plugged right in there. So we might have even actually stepped on it on accident. But little lift, clean, and replace. This is what he's got here. Pretty, pretty. I mean, it's a pretty easy chip because the greens are probably really soft right now. So you should be able to get this kind of close, I think. I'm, I, hey, I'm instantly. I'm down on the count, baby. This is this is when things get interesting. I gotta take an early lead here, folks. I feel like this match is gonna go into a playoff hole today. It could. It could very well go into a playoff hole. Okay, that was a terrible shot, guys. Uh oh, that is that's gonna be a challenge. Up, hey, <laughs> shut up. I'm probably gonna start with the bogey, guys. Actually, I'm gonna make that. So, ah, not a solid start. I mean, I had a good shot off first tee. I think I should have hit six iron, not seven iron. Uh, but sometimes you just miss club, you know. Sometimes in life you just come up short, kind of like you. <laughs> All right. Get it? It was short. Matt, short and a little right of the pin. Obviously, I got this up the hill for a par, which I'm going to need to make that because I have a solid feeling. Matt's going to go ahead and three putt this one. Just kidding. But honestly, three putts in play no matter where you're at on it the really green today. Because I mean, just look at how pure these things are. Yeah, three putts are going to be in play today, folks. My putting's got to be dialed in if I want to win this match. I, yeah, same. It's all going to come down to putting today. I know. If you hit that, that might have went in, Matt. Frick. That might have went in, Matt, if you hit that. I mean, hey, that ain't no gimme. It's really not today. Like, seriously, anything can happen, folks. Nice. Slam it home. Slam it. I have it. to. For short little putts like that today, I'm going to have to slam them home. I can't try and do no break nonsense because I will literally miss it. One little bump on this aerated green still from six years ago, and you will miss putts. Putting, literally, it's going to come down to putting, and it literally, I have a feeling it's going to come down to playoff hole as well. Got to be banging putts today. Yeah. Garrett really looking at this one, folks. It is uphill, luckily for him, and it is going to be breaking from his right to left. I call this one in the hole, guys. He says it's in the hole here. I'm a happy cheeto. He is a half-eaten Cheeto, folks, and he stays even with me. What a great pot. Even par, two even pars after hole one. Yes. Hole two. All right, so after hole two, or <laughs> shut up. <laughs> after hole one, me and Garrett are tied with pars, and now we're in hole two. This is about 120 yards from here. Um, No wind, pretty much not not really a lot of wind on this hole. There is no flag. There's a flag stick. Three times with Steven the other day, and I left it short every time. So, so this could be a really good shot, or it could be a really bad shot. So you could try to overcompensate. I played it earlier this morning. I hit it to six feet. You're short there, but he's still putting for a birdie. I mean, that was right at it, though. Yeah, I'm hey, it's a little scary. I'm feeling kind of dialed, so it's not good for you. <laughs> Shut up. I'm still fine. <laughs> yeah, you're fine. Um. Can you follow that one in the air? This whole no caffeine thing is gonna work eventually, one day. Like, I'll be fine. I'll feel to my normal self. I'm still having anxiety. Cut a tad bit, man. Look at that pro tracer, guys. That's short, not a good short, shot. Short, long. That's we'll gonna be a tough pot. That was a little short there. That was a little short. Shut up. All right, of course, Garrett hitting a dialed-in shot right here. It's definitely not a gimme by any means, but it's a really easy putt up the hill. And meanwhile, I am 95 feet above the pin, and I got to putt through this nonsense. Crap. Camera toss. One, two, three, cap. Yes. Yeah, Love that's on. That. That's what I'm looking at for birdie. I'm feeling kind of dialed. I've already said it before, but I got some confidence in today's match. I'm feeling like a half-eaten Cheeto. <laughs> I got to putt through this. Putting through a little volcano. I have made a putt from here, and I think you have two or something. Yeah, we've, I'm I, sure I, we we've both made some crazy putts from up here, but... Just gotta dial it in. Dial it in. Well, I had a feeling it was gonna do that, but honestly... That's not bad. It's not, not bad. Make hey, it par. You got that for par, and... I'm gonna mark it, and hopefully you miss. I'm taking this really serious today. Good yes, job. he's marking his ball, getting it cleaned off. He's really taking it serious. This is this is definitely a makeable putt for Garrett, but it's definitely missable for him as well. Yeah, that's your name or whatever. He's feeling confident and good, and that's a good thing in a match if you want to win. You think about the math. Oh no, see that's what I'm talking about. He hit a little thingy and it bumped it the exact wrong way. That's this is a chance for me, folks. Hey, I don't even think this is a gimme. That's what we're saying, folks. And no gimme's out here. The ball can move. It <laughs> It did move. That's what I'm saying. Oh my god. Dude. That's crazy. Your putt literally did this. Yeah, both of them did. I hit two solid putts and luckily still made bar. That's what I'm saying, guys. Like, Matt's putt here, I don't even know, like, which way it's going to go. It's supposed to go that way. Yeah. Technically speaking, but it could go that way. So, who knows, man. <laughs> and I got this, what is this in front of my ball here? Any other golf course, this is a straight in easy putt. 
Yeah. If you're at Augusta National? No. Not easy when you're playing at Augusta. Oh, hey, that was good. Was that good still was like weird. It's still a little wobbly, still a little, little wobbly. Shut up. So we're even poor now through two. All right, so we are even through two holes here. And this hole is actually a really big decider hole, I feel like, sometimes. This one and hole four are two holes where I think most of the strokes are actually where some stuff actually happens. So stay tuned for that. Ooh, the wind's a little uh, left to right here, folks. A little breezy. A little breezy. Hell breezy. Hell breezy. Oh, I barely made contact with the ball. That was a hook. Folks. Uh-oh. I have an opening slot! Yeah, guys. Honestly, it wasn't a terrible shot. I just hit it on the heel. It was a good swing. Didn't hit it solid. Opening slot has been opened. Wow. Guys, he's got a big opportunity here. I pulled that. I just pulled it, honestly. I just pulled it. You know what? <laughs> just pulled it. Matt's got a huge opportunity here to get dialed. I have to. Guys, this is a great opportunity to get involved. Yeah, huge opportunity to get involved. And I barely made contact as well, folks. Guys, wow, it, the green is wide open and we just missed, it's open. Open, O-M-P-E-N. You guys, we just messed that up very badly. I barely made contact and I went straight right. He barely made contact and hit it left. Uh, I told you, this is where stuff gets real, really freaking stupid. All right, Matt, here on the right side, trying to get this one up and down for a par. For a par. Um, I'm just over there on the left side, just past the bunker, so we both have shots in order to get up and down for par. Not in the best position. We got some people who randomly just jumped in front of us on the next hole, not really sure who they are or what they're doing, but good for them. You know what? Good, good for, them. for them. Good good, good for you guys. 56 here, you guys. Trying to land it pretty close to the hole. Honestly, not too bad. It's downhill, unfortunately, so it's going to be a little tougher putt, but I can make it. You can technically. <sighs> let me know who you guys think is going to win right now. And let me know if you think it's going to go into playoff holes. And let me know if you stay good at a grip. <laughs> that putt is going to be tricky. So yeah, like, see, there's a bunch of water over there, so we'll probably move it if we land short or whatever. But Garrett now has a tricky, tricky chip. And he makes it look pretty, pretty simple. That might actually go in, folks. Oh, you, no way. Guys, I thought I made it. Oh my, no way. He's got a tap and par, and now I'm in a tough position because I need to make mine. Stay it even. Garrett, of course, with the tap and par there. Holy buckets of smoke. It's coming down to smoke and buckets. Dude, that ain't no easy putt. That ain't no gimme. That ain't no give me. Give me a reason to slap you in the mouth real quick. <laughs> All right, so Matt's obviously down the hill here. Putting from about four feet, right to left, but it could go left to right, so you really don't know. Wearing a Dwayne The Rock Johnson shirt. Rep it, baby. If you guys don't have it yet, go get some. Cause What's your referral code? Um, <laughs> you don't have one. Steer 93. <laughs> Knees. It went the wrong way. It went the it, opposite. It breaks from right to left. But it went to the right. Guys, we need some birdies in today's challenge because we have not had any birdies. Huh? I told you, hole three or hole four, this is where stuff gets iffy. Now I'm one over and he's even. What are the odds of that, too? I hit a bad shot, you had a door opening, and then you just shut the door on yourself. Slammed. I shut the door on my... You, I opened it and shut it on myself, which and is really... You shut it on one of your fingers, broke your finger, and slammed your nose against the handle. Yeah, and then walked away like a champion. No, I did. Okay. Right? I walk away with victory, Garrett, no matter what, even though I... Broke four teeth. Shoot! I'm one over you guys. Losing by one. Hole four. Gotta make something happen. Garrett says he's gonna try and knock this one in the hole. Like he's super confident about it, but I smell a fin. I smell a fin or a toppy or a chunky toppy. Put that on a t-shirt. Garrett now. Could go in. Oh. Long, folks. That was right at it. It was right at it, but I have a chance to get it close. Heart was beating on that one, folks. Yeah, it was. Thought I made it. Um, I fill him with a venom. Guys, I ate. Hey. 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 Did you follow that one or no? I got most of it. Yeah, I got it. Knock it within a foot, folks. Right within a foot. That's easy within a foot. That's an easy tap in birdie. Wait, he actually made that in his bag. I was zoomed in on his face hole, but I didn't really see it, but I did. Do it again. <laughs> Second try. Oh! <laughs> Let's freaking go, baby. Why can't I hit golf shots good, though? 
Yeah, I dropped my I may or may not have dropped my camera yesterday So it's a little it's a little tough on the on the zoom and in part Garrett actually landed a lot longer than I thought he would and he's got himself a tricky little putt But meanwhile, I didn't even land the green but it's chip inable from where I'm at, I think. So we'll have to see what happens. Dude, when these greens get dialed in in the summer, we might be shooting some dirty scores. Yeah. Just so you guys know, I've shot 600 at this course. So is Micah. So we might have to make a video pursuing the 600, birdieing every hole. All right. Matt's dialed in, chipping it down the hill. That's in. Oh, that's not in. It's not in. It's that's not a gimme. Jeez. Whew. Ooh. What a camera toss. What a Great camera day. toss. I tapped it. All right, Garrett now to clinch and go up two here, but a very tough putt. And I also don't have no gimme, so. I feel like, yeah. It feels like, yeah, folks. Think about it. I don't know what that was, folks. This is breaking hard. That broke up the hill. You saw that. That started to go up that way. We need to figure out these green sunflowers. I'm going to talk. All right, this is not, I'm, I'm not even kidding with you guys. This is not a gimme. <laughs> That's like, that's so shaky. Yeah. I don't know if that's going in. You gotta kinda just, when you're in the in close proximity, you kinda gotta hit it hard and make sure it goes in. Yeah. Matt needs to really dial it in here. Like, I need to make this if I want a chance to survive. Yeah, because he does not want to go two down into the last two holes, especially since I have a feeling I'm going to birdie one of them. Why do I feel like someone's going to make a hole-in-one in today's video? Guys, if you think someone's going to make... You've done it once. If, I, if anybody makes a hole-in-one or gets within three feet, everyone has to like the video. Oh, right, baby. Literally, it hit right here. Yeah. Kind of got to hit it really hard, and hopefully it goes in, and it did. So, still one down after four. We can still do some work. We can still make something happen here. So, make some magic throw around happen. We're going to hit a shot, guys, from right here off the back of this green all the way to the next hole, which is like 200 yards away. Yeah. It's into the wind. So, I got five in, which, once again, might not be enough. We're just going to do a close to the pin for fun. Literally, okay. no reason. For 100 bucks. Oh, jeez. All right. So, there is something on the line. And you got to go some th through some. Through some trees. Yeah, and the pin's way back there. I'm trying to follow this, but no gimmies. Holy. Just drew it. That was there. I swung hard. Did it, did it get there? Yeah, I think it was there. I had to. I just drew it. Dang, I hit that so good. Guys, Mike is going down next match. I mean, honestly, I hit it right on my line of my divot. And that one is God, right. I hit a cut too. Yeah, all right, divot's where I needed to hit it. Yeah, just had that face a little too open. A little too open. Open, open. So, no, did anybody get on? Did you get on the green or no? I think I'm left of the green. Just left. Okay. So, I guess what we're going to do is since nobody hit the green, we'll just stay poor. All right. I'm not even kidding right now. Guys, I, I have a... Oh I just my. rolled my angle. I have a serious question for the comments. Do you guys... Have you ever, like, been on caffeine for, like... I mean, like, for a solid two, three months straight, I was drinking, like, two cups coffee a day and maybe a cup of coffee and a bang energy drink. Now, my body is... It's feeling okay. It's starting to get better because it's on day seven. I feel like I'm outside of my body. Like, something's happening to me and I'm having caffeine withdrawals. So I don't know if you guys have ever done this or if you felt what I'm feeling, but if you have, let me know in the comments down below. I'm actually talking better now too, which is good. So like I'm making progress, but I'm still having some anxiety at night. So it's just weird. It's just weird, guys. Let us, let us snow. Let us, let us snow. Think about it. Yeah, it feels really good though. Jump in a pot. Let's get back to what we're at right now. This match, I'm still one down and you're still three six. So I gotta make something happen here, folks. I, whew, I just feel like this one's gonna be really close. Yeah, could be, could very well be. I've said that on every shot. Yeah, you have. Oh and no. I pulled it left. It didn't push. Oof, that was bad. There it is. Yeah. I don't know what I was thinking. I was trying to play a little What squirt. were you thinking? Squirt right. Just didn't squirt on me. You guys know what I'm talking about. All right, Matt's got a 65 degree. Actually, I actually have 56 here. I had 52. So I, I lost my 56. But I don't think I could get 60 there. Because last yeah. time I was really short, so. You guys, I think 56 is a play. Mm. I didn't like that. I did not like that yeah, one. Yeah, he's got the yips. Got his Yeezys on. See, I didn't, I didn't like the swing. I didn't like what I was doing. I didn't like one bit of it, and it goes to show. You look cinematic right now, though. Micah, what are you doing to this man? Team Fun Size is rubbing off on each other. Literally rubbing off on each other. God, I didn't like I didn't like any of that. I didn't just I just didn't like the swing. Guys, <laughs> how mad is getting up and down from par? You get up in par from the bushes, and I'm gonna do it. It's a lot of kinetic energy there. A lot of small stuff going on. Guys, here's where Matt's pulling it up, just short of this whatever creek water whatever uh this is kind of what he's looking at he's got that pin kind of in the front side he's gotta get this one up and down this has to be an up and down par folks it has to be it has I to want be. a chance it really does i don't have a lot of green to work with either no he does not this is a scary shot especially right. after a shank get up 
Not bad, just short. Pretty solid short shot. You got but clearly I've hit a really fantastic shot here and I'm about 96 feet for a par. Go me. Garrett meanwhile has a pretty pretty good look at birdie here. Um, I need him to two to three putt actually uh, for me to have a chance here. So I doubt he'll do that. I bet he'll put this pretty close to make it or he'll either make this putt. I'm not saying I'm out because I can still make my par putt, but I'm not making it easy on myself right now, folks. That would have went in if he hit it, folks. Tap in par there. All right, I got to make mine now. Matt's really, he's kind of dialed out of the action. Um, I'm even par. So honestly, even par is not too hard. Like you should, I think that's beatable, especially today. I mean, I don't know. The conditions are pretty good other than the greens. So the conditions are tough out here, honestly. They're tough, tough scoring conditions today. We got some bumps on the greens. Sweatpants pants on and yep. really nice weather. Greens are rolling about us. 36. 36 at least. Um, what, are, what are you doing? All right, this has to go I in. My, Matt is, you know, he's taking his time on this and I, I respect it because he has to make it. Literally, pretty much has to. Unless he makes a hole in on the last hole with. It is possible, in theory. It's very possible, hole six. Yeah. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I might have done it. Oh, you oh. might have done it. He almost did it. Ah. I was, I was saying. I was rooting for myself. Yeah, a sports center, top sports three. Sports center, top four. 56. Nice Go play. me. Nice. Ah, you almost made that, man. Two over going to last hole, you're two down. What is what is your strategy? What's your game plan? Uh, honestly, you know, it's probably one of those things where I just, you know, I kind of lost it after hole three. Um, I know my mentality started to go after I shanked on hole four there, but um, I kind of need to make that par, and I didn't, I, I did give it a chance, kind of. It lipped on the bottom side, but, um, you know, there's always a hole-in-one opportunity on hole six here, which I think I can make, and, you know, hopefully that, uh, the, the Garrett doesn't, you know, hit, you know, good shot, but it's just one of those tough things, man. Yeah, no more questions. It's gonna be great. Uh, hole six, Garrett is now two up here, and I'm now two over, uh, which is really, 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 really bad score. Garrett needs to hit a really crappy shot and make bogey, and I need to make birdie, and I still won't, uh, well, that'd be two strokes, wouldn't it? That's what needs to happen if I wanna have a tie, if I wanna tie the match. Yeah, well, that's not gonna happen. I need to make a hole in one and you need to miss. Yeah, I think I almost made that. That was pretty good there, folks. Great performance, Matt. Thanks. Uh, mm. Thanks, Gary. Matt with a 60 degree, uh, trying to get closer to that, which is not going to be too easy. Um, I could be pretty close in there, pretty tight. I mean, it has to go in, guys. Yep, has to go in, folks. Left it out right. Would have went in, though. Yeah, would have went in. That would have went in. That was the perfect club choice, uh, yep. perfect opportunity to make it. And, you know, it's just, it's it's tough. It's one of the things where you, you play golf and you really start sucking. Uh, mentally, physically, it starts draining on your whole entire body. And, uh, and at the end of the day, you're either gonna you're either gonna wake up and you're gonna figure out what you wanna do with your life or you're not. And unfortunately, I haven't. Um, so I wanna thank you guys for all coming out and doing interviews. Uh, this is gonna be my last question of the year probably. And, uh, and hopefully you guys can have a fantastic day. Thank you. Yeah, he put this thing close, folks. He's got an easy tap in birdie, which he will make, and I would be happy to make even a birdie here today. You know, I came out here, I played kind of piss poor. You know, my energy was freaking low, and uh, and I don't really like that. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video. This is uh, unfortunately gonna be, this is gonna be it. This is me uh, signing off for golf. Uh, this is the last time I've ever played. No, this uh, this is actually a fantastic shot by G here. He will uh, he will make that probably for birdie. I'm gonna have a long birdie putt as well. At least I have a birdie putt. And let's see what happens. Yeah, I'll film you. Guys, I'm gonna film me getting this divot down here. Look at that. That is clean right there. That's how you fix a divot. That's not a knife. Now that's a knife. That's a knife. That's a knife. That's a knife. No, that's not a knife. Now that's a knife. <laughs> Such a good movie. I was breaking really hard, uh, pretty good distance from right to left. Be great if this goes in. Got some worms in the way. You know, tough condition. What a putt, what a stud, what an athlete. Go in, really go in, go. Left side. Yep. Really fantastic putt. I'm gonna tap it in for a par. Yeah, you thought, you, you thought. <laughs> yeah. Shut up. Good Just go ahead and make this, make a good solid par, birdie. Eagle. And you did. Barely, holy moly, Barely. dog. Thank you guys for watching. That's the end of the video. Uh, and I, I came out here with high hopes and, and high dreams and standards, and I didn't live up to it. So Garrett did take the dub here, and he wins a mil, and uh, and I'm going to be bankrupt uh, in my jail cell.
crying like a little tiny baby. It's a really fantastic play. You th I thought you said you were bad, and I thought I could, you know, I'd take advantage of that, and I and I didn't. Um, I'm playing like some of the best golf right now. Just yeah. so you guys know, I'm not hooking anymore, so I'm feeling great. I just got to get dialed in with my wedges, but that's partially due to me not drinking caffeine anymore. He's focused in. Uh huh. Dialed. Dialed. Uh -huh. That's it. That's the end. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed. So subscribe if you haven't. Subscribe if you're new, old, you don't want to be here, don't really care about it. Subscribe anyway because I said so. And that's pretty much it. We're signing off. Thanks for tuning in, guys. I know I'm a little out of it right now, but that's okay. Give me that saucy.